energy vibration reading for the Virgo Sun Moon and Rising I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um, please listen to your Sun Moon and Rising and I'm asking each and every person out there to like shares and thumbs up these videos um, it is the middle of the month so please listen to the month reading again this week is the week of the lovers uh, an emotional week uh, the week of the hair a lot of things going up a lot of situation that is happening and uh, there's a lot of situation that is uh, going to affect uh, relationships so be aware of this okay whatever is happening I'm not liking and I'm not liking whatever is happening you have to deal with the princess of swords and the queen of cups and the prince of cups whoever that person is so let's look and see what is happening new love is coming in for a lot of you the devil is here over your money but it's not gonna work there's a burden with this king queen of sword don't know who that is and what she's playing out in your life but you're feeling that this person is bringing a burden there's new love coming in there's going to be a wonderful um, new relationship coming in your life the two of cups is a positive relationship and this is new love this is intimacy this is um, relationship that is going to last a very long time these are two people who are very connected to each other and the universe is going to bring them together so this new love is coming in it's a week of love and you can see with most of the readings that I've done um, the love energy that is coming in if you're looking for a relationship if you're already in a relationship if you're about to start a relationship it's going to be a very very positive one as we look on Tuesday you have the hurt energy which is a, a, one of your best days you have the ten of Pentacles financial security is coming in for you but you have the energy of the devil the devil this devil have to do with this man whoever this man is he's an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and he is trying to block your financial situation so call upon the angels and let's do this together I'm calling upon the angels and guides to remove this person this king of ones person who is creating cover for removing whatever he is trying to do let him fall in his on his own swords whoever this king of one person is that is causing uh, chaos um, to situation in people life let him fall on his own sword okay you need to learn to remove people out of your life whatever is happening your money is going to be good and I'm going to ask a message about your money because with this man being um, the, the the energy of your week who is going and this can be a Leo it can be um, an Aries or a um, a Sagittarius not really a Sagittarius Sagittarius people are not like that Sagittarius people are nice people okay um, I'm getting this energy of a friend for some this man could be a friend what kind of friend is he I'm hoping that it's a good friend so whoever that person is this could be a friend okay whatever the situation is let's look at your crowning of the week you have the ace of ones which is wonderful the ace of ones is new beginning a new life wonderful experience you have the two of ones new openings new doors new positive um, situation is going to happen in your life so you're getting a new start and a whole lot of doors will be opening up for you so this is very very wonderful um, don't matter who that king of ones is just let it go as we look at Tuesday we have the princess of sword this is a woman between the ages of 18 and 35 whoever this person is she's very bitter she's coming at you and she's very bitter towards you and you feel as if this woman is a burden this can be someone who's in a relationship with an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra you felt as if this woman is a burden so whatever it is ask the angels and guides to help you to release you from that energy of uh, this woman this the, uh, the feeling just send her love and life whoever this woman is okay it can be in a relationship forms it can be your sister it can be a friend whoever that person is 
ask the universe to soften the energy between you both. On a Friday, you have the Prince of Cups. And whatever the situation is, this Prince of Cups is coming towards you. And you are taking a rest from this um, Prince of Cups. This Prince of Cups could be a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpio. Whoever this person is, you choose to take a rest from this person. You don't want to deal with them at this moment. And if that's what your guides and angels are saying, do it. Because obviously, there is something that is playing out. As we look at Saturday, we have the energy of the Six of Wands in reverse. Thank you. I, Whenever the Six of Wands is in reverse, that means whatever situation you are going through is now at an end and you're going to uh, uh, about to start a new beginning um, the energy of the five of cups is here it's like you have regrets over something whatever it is whatever that regrets is I don't think that you have caused this situation this situation has happened and sometimes you can say things sometimes you have to do things and people take it the wrong way and this is how this is happening and you're thinking that it's your fault but it's absolutely not your fault it's just that if sometimes you need to do something and people do not understand maybe you say you know I will call you back or something like that and uh, people take it the wrong way maybe they think something else so let it go whatever it is on Saturday on Sunday you have the Queen of Cups of water energy this is a loving energy whoever this person is it comes up as a mother figure as someone who is protecting you from of the universe world and you have the energy of the devil so the number 15 is going to be your energy vibration of this week whatever is happening the devil seems to be coming oh no debt and transformation so whatever is happening um, there is going to be a transformation with the screen of cups whoever this person is there is going to be a change of energy and it's okay let it go just let it everything work out with itself whoever the screen of cups is whatever is happening um, this Prince of Cups some of you have a relationship with either the Princess of Cups or the Prince of Cups this is a Pisces a Cancer or a Scorpio person and it's a love it's a love affair that you both have together whatever the situation is whatever the love affair is whatever is happening be aware of this because um, as you look in the middle of the week you have the ten of Pentacles the ten of Pentacles with the energy of the devil is that the, the energy of the devil or negative energy is trying to um, block your financial situation but don't worry about it because new love is coming in for you whatever the situation that occurs between you and a loved one um, that you're you know feeling a little bit as if you're having regrets you have no need to have any regrets you have the energy of the princess of swords whoever this princess of swords is she's bringing burden on you release yourself ask the universe to really, really soften up that energy look and see because there is a situation maybe you have a brother that is the Prince of Cups and you're trying to keep him at bay for whatever reason it is because um, your mom and you and your brother is having a situation what is so positive about this week is that the crowning of the week is the ace of ones and the ace of ones is a positive positive energy you have the ace of ones and the ace of cups so new love is coming in for some people and new beginnings are coming in um, if you're looking for work it's going to be a wonderful week it's going to be a positive week because you are going to get a lot of uh, invitations we're working with the unicorn in this week so let's look and see what they're saying listen listen and the answer will be revealed listen and the answer will reveal listen if you listen the answer will reveal so if there's a situation that you're not understanding what's going on listen to yourself be still listen to yourself and the answers will come in 
I want to say to each and every person sometimes we're bothered by something and we're trying to figure out something all we have to do is take the time to quiet yourself ask the unicorns ask the angels and guides uh, to show you um, whatever clarity that you need and that clarity will come in I want to say to each and every person please like share these videos if you'd like a personal readings please order a reading off the website the link is um, below on the videos thank you for being here namaste yeah.